Hello and welcome to Forgaming. Gaming. My name's Captain Oz, and it's been a while. Um, it hasn't. I think it was the weekend just gone. We did the MCM video. It was great fun. Um, but now we have Loot Crate. <laughs> I'm so happy. It's actually arrived. Where are we? A little bit towards the end of the month. Um, I'm not sure how the sound's going to be on this video because I am. I'm, I'm recording off of, of the Zoom again, um, but I am using a lapel mic. Is just, just there. Just, it blends in with my top it's black. So I'm going to see how I get on with that. And there may be a bit of distortion there where I just grabbed it, but let's have a look. Right, I haven't actually, normally I've broken the seal on this, but I haven't even broken the seal on these. On this van. So there we go. Put the knife back in the sheath. There we go. Right. Let us begin. So this is the loot crate for. It is May. I forgot the date. Ooh. This is the loot crate for May. And before I go, before I start going through, I just sort of. Ooh, look. Ooh. Let's try and find uh, the book. Is the book? It is. There it is. Okay. So same as normal. We'll keep. I will look at the lens. Same as normal, we'll start, start with the book and then we'll go through in order as it says in here. So this theme, this month's theme is Unite. As always, there is the cover with lots of different handshakes and things on the back. So, um, dee -dee -dee. So as normal, there is all of our photos from previous crates. Uh, and there's a little, the greatest comic teams of all times there. Uh, 10 years of Boom Studios. Ah, there we go, the main mega crate. Uh, worth $2,000. My God. Right, we have a Team Fortress 2 Buff Banner Backpack. I don't see it. Is it that? I don't know. Team Fortress 2 Archimedes Plush. Team Fortress 2 Red Team Scarf and Blue Team Scarf. Team Fortress 2 Bandolia Scarf. Bandolier Scarf. I may be butchering that completely. Um, a TF2 Blind Box Portable Mercs 3 inch figurine. Uh, DC Comics, A Visual History, HBO's Game of Thrones, 7 inch Iron Throne replica, it's pretty funky. Um, signed Rick and Morty script, signed Rick and Morty skateboard, uh, as, as a Hulkbuster statue, and a PS4 limited edition Batman Arkham Knight 500 gigabyte bundle. So there is the mega quote for this month. Again, all valued at over $2,000. Normally it's got the price of each thing next to it, but it hasn't in this one. Uh, oh, there's a, a, a mini Mega Crate. 20 lucky winners win a Funko Mini Wacky Wobbler set, Avengers 2, and Bravest Warriors Volume 1. So that's a little bit in the bottom corner there. Um, I think that's the first mini, mini Mega Crate thing they've done. I may be mistaken. I can't remember. Right, number one. Exclusive Green Ranger T-shirt. Right, so here we go. So that would be. Oh, yeah. Did I change? Yeah, I changed my size on these from medium to large. I I found um, the mediums were a little bit too tight on my shoulders. So uh, can you see all that? There you go. That is Green Ranger design. So that's pretty funky. I was never really a fan of the Power Rangers. I never, I never got into it. That is a pretty cool design. Fold that up a bit easier. That gets out of my way. Um, as normal, obviously bear in mind, I will, there will be a cut somewhere in the middle of this because of, that, of the annoying nine-minute recording thing on my camera. There's no four or five minutes left before I've got to do it again. Right, number two. 
Um, Avengers Age of Ultron car decal. Uh, where are you? Okay, so that's not sure how well you can really see that, but there's the decal there. That's pretty funky. Well, that's the image of the decal. The decal's actually on the back, but it's on a it's a white decal on a white bit of on white bit of paper. So you can't really see it in the camera. You can just about make it out looking at it. But that's pretty funky. But and if I had a car, um, next we have exclusive team at TF2 button set. Um, I did see these over out. So we have a little collector set of four TF2 badges. So the camera's behaving relatively well today with the focusing. Although I have got my uh, spotlights on, so a bit of a glare and my hair is getting in my face. Next, we have a Bravest Warriors. Um, Number one, look like exclusive for Bravest Warriors Tales from Hulu John. Hulu John, Hulu John. Um, B thing, right? Okay, so that's this. How's that? Okay, so God, it should look, look great everywhere. <laughs> uh, if I just sort of do that and I'll scan it down. So there you go. One comic book. She's loot crates everywhere. <laughs> Maybe one of the ones that I actually have never have a read of. So I have too much to read at the moment, so I haven't actually opened any of the other loot crate comics or uh, read any of the books I've got actually. I still need to read uh, the Ready Player One book that I got. Oh, hello. Was that a turn around, turn back, and it was all blurry? Right, next. Oh, that's what that is. Right, okay. So we have. Oh, is there any content? Okay. So this is a Marvel Superheroes ice tray. So there you go, if I just... So we have... Fist, the shield... Uh, Iron Man's head... Two Iron Man's head? I think it was two, two Iron... Two, it was two Iron Man's head... Two of Cap Shields, a fist... Another fist. What's that? Is that a thing? That's not very, it's just Marvel. It's. God, I'm looking at something over there. It's just Marvel. So you've got the thing, I'm assuming thing, Hulk, Iron Man, and Captain America. So, this is a pretty. I was, look, I was looking to get some ice cube, some, uh, ice cube type trays. I already have a uh, Space Invaders one, which is quite nice. Which my one of my friends got me actually at uni. What's going on? What's this? Marvel US contest. Of course, in the US. Create and share your own Marvel inspired drink utilizing the ice cubes from the Marvel ice cube tray included in this month's crate. Categories are categories include best shot, best mix, best blend, and more. Uh, more details on the website. So if you want to go and have a look, you can. Next, unite this job there. Exclusive Mad Magazine Loot Crate Edition. Oh, it's two magazines. Unite the stupid. Okay. I've always been interested in Mad. Now I get to read one. So there is a Loot Crate exclusive Mad magazine. That's pretty funky. Oh, put that over there. And I've just seen the time on that, so bear with me. There will be a little bit of. There we go. I told you there'd be a cut. Aha! At least this time I, I noticed. <laughs> Right, uh, we have a set of Marvel sneaker laces. So there's actually there's a pair pepper pack, but there's actually two pictures in here. So I'm assuming. Uh, I think it's a random pair. Yeah. One of the other two, so it's, it's the same design, but one's colour, one's black and white, and they just feature your favourite Marvel characters. So I've got the colour ones, so I'm not sure how well you're going to be able to actually see that, 
Can you can you make that? Can you make that? Out? I'm not sure. I can barely, I can barely make it out looking at the damn thing. But there are some Marvel laces. They may they may end up on my trainers. And I saw the button. Where's the button? There's the button. So that is the root crate. The night button. There you go. There's another adult thing. So let's put that. I dropped my microphone. Not the best thing to do. There we go. There may be a little bit of a bang there. I'll try and uh, quieten that. I'll put it in my lap. I'll try and quieten that when I... Um, is it recording? Yeah, it's recording. I'll try and quieten that when I'm in the editing. If that's uh, loud. Uh, and final thing, I believe we're on the final page, is an exclusive Rick and Morty 300-piece jigsaw puzzle, which uh, is actually in a box. It's quite cool. In a little box, it's a 300-piece puzzle, and it's probably going to be easier to show you the picture in the book rather than the little one in the box. There is... Should be able to make that out. That is the puzzle. So that's pretty funky. Is it just, is it just standard pieces or it's types? I will leave that in the box. I don't actually have anywhere at the moment to do a puzzle. It could be an issue. I'm gonna have to take over the dining room table for a bit. And then as the final piece we have it's a locker room. It is a locker room. Uh, so, let's undo the box and turn it inside out. I like doing this bit. I actually want this closed. I think this one stays open. But essentially, it's a locker room scene. Yeah, I think actually, that one actually stays open. There's a locker room scene. You cut uh, the bottom bit there, and then there's a bench there to cut out, which goes. There's little holes to pop out there. So that bit would go up. So yeah, you don't actually close this one. Which is a little bit of sod, so this probably won't make it onto the shelf. For the simple fact that it needs to be open to properly show what it is. And I don't think I have the room on any of those shelves for such a box. A bit of a shame. It is quite a nice scene. Let's put that. Let's go, there we go. And as always, I will just put everything straight on my shelves now that I have them. So that closed and goes to there. So, hit on the head, it has getting in the way. Just that little bit, right, red, red there. That, that bit <laughs> is the main problem. Poke me in the face. Um, so yeah, that's this month's Loot Crate. Uh, please like, share and subscribe. There will be a link in the description below um, if you could put uh, for the Loot Crate website. Uh, I'll also include a link to uh, the MCM video that we did this weekend, just gone. Uh, if you missed it, brilliant event. If you don't know what it is, go and take a look. Again, there's more links in that in that video for all the M MCM stuff. Brilliant Comic Con event. Uh, we had fun playing games. We got to play the new Lego uh, Jurassic Park. And is that the focus playing up? I can't tell. I can't tell if the focus is playing up or not. That looks better. Is it not? So I sit back. That looks better. Right. Yeah, I'll put the links in the description below. Please don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe, and we'll see you all next time.
See ya.